Ladies and gentlemen, this is Joe's Classic Video Games back with another amazing arcade game for you this evening. Check out what we have in this video here. This is Namco's incredible, legendary, awesome, oh my god, haven't seen one of these in years, Time Crisis 2. Check it out. This is the single player cabinet. Um that you could link together. They also made two player cabinets and then they made these big huge ones with projection screens and stuff. This is kind of the smallest one. As you can see, I'm standing 15 feet away and can barely get it in the camera. It's huge. What a cool game. Really fun to play and what a cool design for a uh, for a cabinet. Namco kind of was like Sega, man. They made some they made some uh, really cool cabinets. Just the design was awesome. You look at it, immediately you know what game it is. So we've been working on this one a little bit. Finally got it finished. Been playing it a little bit. Super fun. So I figured, hey, you know what? Our friends on YouTube would love to see what this thing looks like. So I figured we'd film a little video. Again, I think the cabinet design on this was awesome. So it's got this big, huge, and, and again, there's a two-player version and a huge version with big projection screen um, monitors uh, that the cabinet's different, but this was the, the single cabinet, the smallest cabinet, basically. Um, big, huge light box at the top, which uh, is able to remove. It's, got, it's just a big, huge box, very cool. And they did this cool little thing where the left side of both cabinets, and I, I say both cabinets because in a lot of places you would have this one and then you'd have another one sitting right next to it. So the left side is all red. And as you can see it says 1998 right there in big lettering. And then on this side, it's all blue. Very cool. Um, the bezel around the monitor is red on this one but they made them with a blue bezel too and then it would have blue trim on the uh, on the uh, pedestal here and a blue gun maybe um, and so you could link the two together look at that monitor mm, man it looks great <laughs> it's not perfect but it looks really cool so let's read some of this side art time crisis 2 there's another plot for the world in 1998 mission Prevent the launch of an enemy military satellite. It's not even one satellite, folks. It's like 64 satellites, I think it said. 64! Just imagine. We have no time to be lost. With your partner, shoot all enemies. Is the evil wild dog still alive? Who knows? I love how they use the old school... Uh, if you used to do any kind of graphics, you know, check it out. They use the old school gradient on it. Look at that. It goes from purple or like a blue over here to a purple. And you can see the the uh, halftones and stuff the way it was done. Old school like you used to do. And uh, look at that. I'm getting even a, a uh, more pattern. Moray pattern? Getting a moray pattern just looking at it because all the halftone dots. Look at that. Awesome. <laughs> At least I thought it was awesome. And then the red side, of course, is the same thing, just in red. It's got a real Japanese look. And then we looked at the uh, the top. We have satellite. We have no time to be lost. So it's basically the same stuff that was on the side, just arranged different. You hear that hum? Mm, we got it turned up too loud, I think. Here's a little warning at the top. I'll read it for you. You might not be able to make it out. A very small percentage of the population has a condition which may cause them to experience epileptic seizures or have momentary losses of consciousness when exposed to certain kinds of television pictures or patterns that are commonly present in our daily environment. 
These persons may experience seizures while watching certain kinds of television pictures or playing some video games. People who have not had any previous seizures may nonetheless have an undetected epileptic seizure uh, condi condition. I'm not trying to make light of this, folks. I'm just saying that they were forced to put this on there because of that this issue. Um, if you or anyone in your family has experienced symptoms linked to an epileptic condition, seizure, or loss of awareness, immediately consult your physician before using any video games. We recommend parents observe their children while they play video games if you or your child experience any of the following symptoms, dizziness, altered vision, eye or muscle twitches, involuntary movements, loss of awareness, disorientation or convulsions, immediately discontinue use and consult your physician. All right. Namco, action pedal. Release. Release pedal and you hide and reload. Press pedal and you go forward and shoot. Game screen. Bullets remaining. When out of bullets, release pedal to reload. Life. Each time you are hit or time expires, you will lose one life. You are, maybe that doesn't say hit. Yeah, hit. When all lives are gone, game is over. Time limit. Time has expired. You lose one life. So there you go. Look how cool this cabinet was. Just so sweet. It's got uh, little casters under it. Um, they call this the pedestal, the front part. It's got these little wings that stick out from the side to make sure that you don't tip it over. I'm thinking there may be some artwork missing that was on here, but I don't know. I haven't looked at the flyer or anything. But it looks really good the way it is. It kind of has a real clean look to it. And, uh, Wow, what a cool game. Now, originally, these had big old pistols on them, but they replaced it. We've talked about it in other videos here. Um, they replaced it with a standard HAP 45. So some of the, I, I don't know if they were all like it, but most of them had like a recoil that it did, like a little coil inside the gun as you, as you shot. Uh, but this one doesn't. It's just a standard HAP 45. In some ways, that sucks because it doesn't do the recoil thing. But in other ways, this gun is very repairable. You can buy parts for it. Um, there's millions of them. This is the, the gold standard of uh, light guns for arcade games. So if you can get by the that it doesn't look quite as cool, and if you can get by that the recoil doesn't work, you know, I'd much rather have the, the HAP 45 like that on it. So there you go. What I will do is set up the tripod and we'll play through it a little bit. I haven't played this in years, so I don't remember uh, the storyline or anything. Now, um, of course, this is Time Crisis 2. Before Time Crisis 2, there was Time Crisis 1, the original Time Crisis. And then there was this one, Time Crisis 2. This, is, this may be the most famous one of the whole series. After this, there was Crisis Zone in a much bigger cabinet with a much bigger gun. After that, there was Time Crisis 3, and then recently there was a Time Crisis 4. Lots of crisi. That's plural for crisis. So uh, there you go. We'll, uh, we'll set up the tripod and we'll play through it a little bit, and you can tell me uh, what you think. All right, we're going to film the uh, the game booting up because it's really cool on Time Crisis. Check that out. Power on test. Sub CPU initializing. Check out Pac-Man at the bottom. Very cool, very cool. Just checking a bunch of stuff, making sure everything uh, tests out right, make sure the RAM's doing its thing, make sure that the... Uh... The PC ZRAM, we all know what that is, I mean, <laughs> is working. DRAM Bank B, I mean, it got you 11J. I mean,
data ROM read check O. Oh. Here we go, folks. Here we go. I can see it coming. Oh, and it's here. It's got that strong base. We'll film the uh, we'll film the attract mode just a little bit. Up at the top, it keeps wanting you to link the game. We've only got one of them. I can't figure out how to turn that off where it just says one player. So there may actually not be a way. It may just say try two player cooperative play, even if you don't have a second uh, game. Whenever you go to start the game, it won't let you select that mode, but I can't get it to not say it on the attract mode. But So I'm, I'm not sure if there's a, a setting somewhere that I'm not aware of or a little jumper that I need to remove. But is dispatch two agents to prevent the launch. Keith Martin. Robert Baxter. Notice in the corner it says, Free Play, Christy Ryan. Uh-oh. And there's Wild Dog. It's almost ready. My dream will soon come true. Ha 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 ha. Ernesto Diaz. Four, three, two, one. Boom. That's how you do it, folks. Let's try this sucker out. I'm going to try not to knock over the tripod. So you can't, you can't uh, shoot the top one. Let's see if I can stand where I don't. Christy, I there found some data about the That's satellite network. Haven't the agents left yet? Keith and Robert are on their way. No one can beat them. No one can Robert. beat them. Oh no! <laughs> there he is. Well, well, it appears we have a guest. Looks like we caught you just in time. A leak like this would have been problematic. To say the least. Oh, no. A punch like that, and you think you're going to conquer the world. Oh, snap. She's talking you trash. Have no idea how perfect our plan is. Now take her away. What the? What the? Oh, no, it's Keith and uh, another guy. Here we go, folks. You ready for this? Fire! Are you ready for this? What's going on? Oh, I wasn't pressing the pedal good enough. I'm an idiot. How you can hide from a uh, missile. No problem holding, hiding from a grenade in this game. Wow. 
Why, yes. Since it's free, why not? Oh, no. Clear. Why? Because I can. That's why. Area 2 start. It's on the other side of the truck. Action! Look at that idiot. It's cool how you hide behind something different depending on where you are. it was friendly fire but oh well Machine gun. Continue. Area two clear.
shot my own guy five times. Really, I don't think I should be blamed for that when he keeps weaving back and forth of my gun. I mean, that's not really that smart. Out of the bullets. how you do it folks all right so there we go that's all i'll play tonight i would be here all night if i played all these games all the way through by the way that is time crisis 2 maniacs have got the military satellite and they're moving it by train we better get going there's no time to lose what a cool game look over there Oh no, what are they doing? Let's go! Let's go. Whoa! There! Go, go, go! Action! Super cool. Continue! So there we go, folks. Game over. Perhaps you remember that one from yesteryear. Now, by the time you see this video, Time Crisis 2 may be off and it's someone else's crisis now. May not even be ours. Um, but you can check out our website to see all the games that we have available right now, even if you're watching us 10 years from now because you're a Time Crisis nut. Uh, you can see all the games that we have for sale right now on our website at lionsarcade.com. Go check it out. Or maybe you're not looking for an arcade game. Um, maybe you just like watching these videos. Because let's face it, this thing takes up a lot of room. Have you seen the pedestal? That's fine. Just uh, subscribe to us here on YouTube. We're going to be filming tons more videos. Every time we get in something cool like this game, we will film a little video of it and upload it for all of our... Uh, all of our YouTube friends. So we will see you on the next video.